Hello, today I'll be showing you how to make an updated Bad Batch and Wrecker's little teddy. First, let's look at Wrecker. I made him using this helmet, which comes from the Black Ace, a standard clone trooper face, a black moustache, Mr. E's neck bracket piece, death trooper legs and body, dark red arms, black hands, a knife and this gun, which I'll show you how to make in a minute. And you put the neck bracket on top of the torso, then the moustache facing backwards, then the head on, and then you put the helmet on, like so, and the moustache covers up that gap which is on the end. And then the knife just goes in his hand, if I can fit it in, which I can. His gun's made in using this piece from Overwatch, a black, a black 1x1 tile, a black 1x2 tile, a 1x1 stud with bar on the end, a black 1x1 stud and a black 1x1 square stud, and then a black 1x1 stud with a bar coming out of it. And then you assemble it like so. And then he's got his commander gun. His little teddy's made using two of these assemblies, which is a one by one see through stud with a bar on the end, and then two black hands. And there's two of those. And then there's also a white stud and a black one by one with a bar coming out of it. And then what you do is you put one of these um, ear assemblies on, and then you put on another. You put the tire on the black stud, and then you put the other assembly on the bottom. Then to make Hunter, you need this first order pilot helmet, regular clone trooper face. First order crew member body put on backwards, dark red arms, a commando pist a commando a commander pistol and a, a grey knife as well as these Imperial pilot legs. His backpack's made using this black neck bracket, a one by two black modified uh, tile piece. A one by one black tile and then a one by one flat stud, see through blue. And then you just put it on like so, and then his head. If you want, you could use this black messy hairpiece, and then the first order pilot's helmet. Then next, which is tech, he uses an imperial scout trooper helmet. Harry Potter's head, this backpack, which I'll show you how to make in a minute, this Imperial Scout Trooper torso with dark red arms, a thermal detonator, a commando, commander gun, this brown Batman belt, and then clone trooper legs. And then you just assemble it like so. You could also use this messy brown ginger hair piece. Then this grey neck bracket piece. A one by one stud with a bar coming out to the side of it. A one by two with a clip coming out. A one by one jumper. A one by one flat tile. And a one by two tile piece and then you make it like so by putting the 1x2 underneath the 1x2 jumper then you put the modified 1x2 there then the flat stud there then this modified grey stud here and then the black grey neck bracket here and then you just put that on the body then the Harry Potter head and the Scout Trooper helmet. There, ah, stop falling over. And then Echo.
Draco is made using this Imperial Black Shadow Trooper helmet, a straight-faced clone helmet, the helmet head, and Sorry, the... I don't have an answer for that. That never happened. And then this piece, this torso piece, which is used in the Jurassic Park or Jurassic World uh, sets, two black pistols with and dark red arms. This custom camera that I made and Death Trooper legs. Um, yeah, if I can just get the camera on, then the torso. And the head and the helmet. Voila! And now we only have one member left. Well, I guess he's not really a member anymore, which is crosshair. I used a Death Trooper helmet or this grey hairpiece, which um, is also in the Black Ace. This head is from Lucius Malfoy. Then a black rifle and the fur the imperial shadow trooper this backpack is made using a black 1x2 a black clip a green translucent stud and this piece which comes from the biplane from um hidden side And then head just goes on like so. The rifle clips on if it wants to. And then the first order Imperial Death Trooper helmet. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. Bye.